Hello guys, uh, today I'm gonna show you a new launcher which I have somehow managed to completely bypass which I really regret. Uh, it might be because of the name Content Manager which doesn't sound very interesting to be honest. <laughs> and It might be just a bit too easy to bypass. But anyway, it's just a launcher, as I said. Mm, it doesn't... You don't need to replace any vanilla files. It comes with the two different versions. There is a light version, which you can use without any cost. It's free. And of course there is the full version. And as we are doing this for fun, I really suggest you to pick the full version. I don't know what's in the light version, but just donate. It's this project is worth donating, and by donating any money you want to donate, you can uh, you get the access for full version. Okay, and let's have a look what's inside it. There is only one exe file. Content Manager and here is the launcher. It's just it doesn't take any time to load. It's really quick. Damn it. Uh, and it has tons of functions. Let's start with the settings. You can create all the settings for adjust all the settings uh, for Assetto Corsa and I think there is a built-in real head motion plugin if someone is really interested I don't see it very realistic but some might see and favor so just use it if you want you can adjust your mirror field of view and everything. It's just there is a tons of things you can adjust. Okay, and then there is the settings for content manager itself. Just tons more. You can take a look at yourself what kind of things there is, but there is all you need and some more. Let's put it that way. Okay. Let's change the car. You can sort the cars by brands, countries, categories, DLCs. So tons of functions. There you have, you can manage your car setups. Mm. You can share setups. So there is a lot of functions you cannot find from standard launcher and on top of that you can select your settings you want to run with it your realism settings and tire blankets just like on our insulin launcher but this is the best thing what comes to car selection you can set car specific controls and as you can see I have no gyro 25% damping with this car which works better than the gyro and this is the great thing I can switch and save uh, some cars to be run with gyro and some don't so it's really really good function I wish that kind of function would be in the standard launcher too okay let's jump into the tracks there we have once again tons of ways to categorize your sort your tracks let's take circuits 
and let's say Capwell Park, which isn't very good mod, to be honest. But you can see that all those layouts doesn't come into the list, so because there are tons of tracks already, uh, it's just better to have folders with different layouts. Okay, nothing more to see here, but this is the brilliant function, real conditions. As you can see, if you choose the real condition, Silverstone, you can see the <coughs> correct time of day. There is some settings for the real conditions. It will choose the closest weather option and the closest temperature you can find. So let's choose a track like Riverside. Okay, let's try that one. And choose the real conditions. You can see time as the course does not support night time, so it will use the closest and the closest temperature 13. Let's have a look if we can find someone. Okay, let's try some Finnish track because I know there should be a lot colder. And as you can see, the temperature is 5. Road temperature 7.1 Celsius and the ambient temperature 5. And mid clear. Oh, yes, it is mid clear weather, so that's the cool thing. Okay. There is a tons of other things I I don't even know yet. I'm not discovered enough, played enough with this launcher, so I might not see some awesome features. You can go online with this, everything. Anyway, if if you if you are interested, buy the uh, or actually, I don't say that way. Download the light version first because you can upgrade the light version in the full version. And as I said, any money you donate will get you in the full version. So. That's but I strongly suggest you to send some money because that's I believe that way we can see a lot more this kind of great applications what comes to our beloved topic. And when we have set everything up on what we wanna run, just hit the go button and there we go. Anyway, that's everything I wanted to say, and bye-bye. See you on track.